This is the future. We all know that Arcane Energize is the most sought out Arcane right now because of how useful it is in maintaining your energy in the mission. The only problem though is if you want a max rank of this Arcane, then you will need to farm the Eidel and Hunts with insanely low RNG, and it would take months to max out the Arcane. If you have the Platinum, then you can spend 2500 Platinum for the max rank Arcane and buy it from other players. Or, you can just pray that Operation Scarlet Spear will somehow make a return in Warframe, However, you don't need Arcane Energize right now after Abyss of Dagath update. There's a certain setup right now that completely get rid of Arcane Energize, and that is the Equilibrium and Synth Deconstruct combo. The Equilibrium mod allows you to convert energy into health and vice versa, while Synth Deconstruct allows health drop from enemies when your companion damage them. This health drop then converted into energy is right now. Equilibrium can pick up health orbs even if your Warframe is at full health. The Synth Fiber mod also lets you do this by the way, but it's kind of worthless right now since it only allows you to pick up health orbs when you are at full health. Equilibrium is a total package since it lets you pick up health orbs even if your health is full, and then this health gets converted to energy. So basically, Synth Fiber got a shadow nerf, and Equilibrium got a massive buff after Abyss of Dagath. The only thing you need to take care now is how frequent you can damage enemies using your companion. In my recent Twitch stream, I have used this setup with Dagath. I was finding a solution on how to further boost the energy economy of Dagath, as the build I was planning is all about killing enemies just by using her abilities. It's kind of a bummer because even with Arcane Energize and her passive, I can't completely spam Dagath's abilities freely. Don't get me wrong, the setup is enough for average Warframe players but for me, I just want to spam her abilities over and over again, never minding about my energy at all in Steel Path levels. Then, I remembered about Pablo's reply to a tweet stating that Equilibrium can now pick up health orbs even if you are at full health and then, I also remembered that the mod called Synth Deconstruct that gives 25% chance to spawn health orbs when you kill an enemy damaged by your companion recently. Now. This needs further testing right now but I think that the duplex bond mod can maximize the energy region potential of equilibrium and synth deconstruct combo. I have tried it a couple of times, and I think that the clone damaging enemies counts to proc the effect of synth deconstruct. Again, it needs further testing but I'm seeing multiple health orb drops on the ground when I kill enemies and mind you, they were not hit by the original companion so, I think it works. With this current setup, you will be freeing one arcane slot intended for arcane energize and somehow, you can modify your build to give more power to your warframe. Also, equilibrium right now opens a lot of synergy and not just energy regeneration through the synth deconstruct mod. You can also abuse the synth deconstruct and equilibrium combo not only in energy regeneration, but also for survivability using the arcane pulse. Overall, the combo is good and quite helpful and right now, it's very reliable since companions are basically immortal and you just need some recovery time mods in your companion to lessen the recovery time. I suggest that you try this combo right now for yourself and before you go, I highly suggest that you go in one of my Twitch stream. Most of the time, I'm trying out builds and stuff in the game to help guys lessen the grind and eventually create fun builds that you can use in the game. Most of the stuff I post in YouTube can be seen on my Twitch stream first. If you have time, come hang out sometimes in one of my streams. The link is in the video description below. Thank you so much for watching. Squad Leader signing off.